right, good evening and welcome to the MEWF Arena for tonight's action-packed card of Mid-Eastern Wrestling. Tonight's card is signed and sanctioned by the Maryland State Athletic Commission, D. Chester Sullivan Chairman. Your referees for tonight's matches are Jeff Jones and Dave Gawain. Your timekeeper at the bell is Jeff Vandor, and I am the voice of the MEWF. My name is Al Albert. Let's bring our first match to the ring. Scheduled for one fall with a 20 minute time limit. Introducing first in the ring at this time, he hails from Baltimore, Maryland. Ladies and gentlemen, Ryan Scott. independent wrestling television show in the region. I'm Mike Nichols along with Jerry Lucifer and the comparable General Stud Lee of the MEWF. Good evening, gentlemen. How you doing there, Mike? How you doing, Mike? It's good to be with you. Uh, Hi, Jerry. I've been better, but then again, that's when you're not on the show. I'm not out here to argue with you tonight, Nichols. I'm out here to call the color like I see it. Well, be my guest. The ring is yours. In the ring, we got Bob Starr taking on this rookie, Brian Scott. This should make for a very interesting matchup. Bob Starr's like the flu, you know? You just can't get rid of him. Yes, indeed. That is certainly correct, General Studley and, and Jerry. I'm telling you, this is an exciting matchup. Bob Starr versus Ryan Scott. Well, you know one thing, Mike, Bob Starr is going to use every illegal hold that he can man maneuver to beat this guy. You know who taught him that, too, don't you, Motion Bird? Are you giving away your secrets? No, uh, not me. Tell us a little bit more about this matchup here tonight. Well, that suplex right there was just shades of Tully Blanchard. <laughs> yes, it was. I'll tell you what, I definitely think the experience is going to prevail in this situation. Bob Starr is a veteran of this ring. Ryan Scott, he's only had one debut, and that was in a battle royal, which he did not win. Well, one thing is for certain, this newcomer, I've never seen him before, Ryan Scott. He's going to have to have a lot of stamina to stay in there with Bob Starr. And stamina is indeed the key here in the MEWF, and Bob Starr, well... Whether you like him or not, he's a good wrestler. Yes, indeed. Well, I don't like him, and... Uh, well, he don't like you either, Jerry. Well, that was a nice maneuver. <laughs> Ryan Scott taking a few punches to Bob's face. Good. That was, again, a nice uh, maneuver by uh, the newcomer Ryan Scott. He came across and dropped him. He's trying to punch his way into victory now. Is this wrestling or boxing? Oh boy, this is Bob's coup de gras. Oh my. Good night. Is this wrestling or boxing? Good night. I guess it's wrestling. Well, Star made quick work of this guy. And, uh, Bob Star is victorious again. Wait a minute, here comes Earl and Pearl. I hear that music. Oh no. This guy is a dancing fool. He's a disco dancer from way back. Getting sick and tired of this guy. I know something's going to happen. I haven't quite figured this all the pearl out yet. I, I haven't either. Uh, can he wrestle? Where is he coming from? Yeah, and he, nobody ever will. He doesn't seem to wrestle that well, but he certainly can dance. Well, shades of Saturday Night Live, Aaron. I mean, Saturday Night Fever, General. Saturday Night Live, that was a joke. Oh, oh I'm sorry. I didn't 
Get that. Well, 